everyone I just wanted to give a quick update on my bare rooted um, light casting that I got this one I got from eBay they sh she she was uh, sending me a bare root like ST had no roots of course just a bulb just one single bulb and it had no name all she said was um, one rooted starter bulb and the color is lime green so I thought I'll just update you on this one so I had it just sitting on top of wet sphagnum moss just moist not damp what I do is just wring out all the excess water and just let it sit in there and it started slowly now this was a few months ago I start I parted this on um, on the 4th of March so it was sitting like that and um, started slowly putting out a new growth and I thought it'll take you along with this and here it is it's almost like an inch tall now so I'm glad uh, this is I'm trying out my light casties I had oh I bought a few bunch of them I have one um, up on just watch it it's on YouTube one of the channel one of those um, videos I have it up so watch it if you have a chance I will appreciate that so here's the one that the bare rooted one uh, so this is from eBay and this is um, another bare rooted like I see that I got there's three of them they were all bare rooted um, this came of course I don't need to tell you what month it was in it was for Valentine's Day that's when I got the all uh, the Lacastis like, ordered, and um, so this was a bare root. There's three bulbs. I put the, both of them. This was uh, this was just in plain sphagnum moss till the new growth started coming out. This I parted up with along with my other Lacastis. Like, it's growing in fir bark, sphagnum moss, perlite, and. Charcoal, um, not char um, um, charcoal, maybe, yeah, charcoal and coconut husks. And um, it's not char coconut husk, it's the fiber, the coconut coir, the powder, like a peat moss like substance. So, this did the same thing, but what this one did was instead of just the new growth, it started putting out spikes. So, the difference when you can tell the difference whether it's a spike or a uh, new growth is the spike will be like more like a pointy thing more pointed whereas the growth will be like split in the middle it, it's you can easily differentiate it uh, in this one anyway I'm talking about but this particular plant I was able to differentiate it so this was how it was when it was growing like a new growth the new spikes were on either side and of course this uh, one was split when it was coming up so it's been like a um, couple of weeks now and before I knew it they already opened up and so this is the flower it's not completely open I'm I'm just trying to show you what it looks like and this is the name of this like Casty. And this is from Ecogenera. So, I'm, I i don't know if I should take the credit for this because it was in bare, bare roots and I planted it and it grew, put out a new growth and new spikes. So, half the credit should probably go to them. And it doesn't matter, it's, I have flowers and, and I'm happy. Um, the camera is showing it as pretty much like a dark brown, I think, but um, Looking a little closer, it has a little bit of green and the brownish tinge. So, even though the pink, like I see a bloom for me earlier, was very pretty and big, this is very small. It's not as big compared to the other one. It is. just that much uh, the other one was almost the size of my pa hand on my palm so this is a smaller variety so um, I thought I'll just take you along for the ride 
and show you the bloom and um, I hope you will all uh, hope you like the video and uh, uh, hope you would like to buy more like Casty. So um, I heard that this is what I was told that they like to be in bright light, but like it cool. So I have I don't have it growing outside in the summer along with my outdoor other plants, which I I take all my plants out for the summer because it's easier for me to water and take care of it outside and inside. So this one. I have it inside where it's of course it's air conditioned all the time so it's a lot cooler than outside so and it's in front of an east facing window so it gets a lot of the morning sun and then by the afternoon like 11 30 on it's just not direct sun but um just diffuse sunlight so it seems to be doing good over there so I'm gonna put it back in that same window and um I guess it's found its happy home so Hope you like this video and thanks for watching. See ya. Bye.